babes welcome back to my channel welcome back to another weekly vlog if you're new here my name is Brittany I am the founder and creator of curvy plus curls and I am currently on my way to the mall y'all it's Friday it's Friday and Friday we celebrate over here so if you're into celebrating and you're into you know just having a great time please consider subscribing to my channel liking this video and also comment below let your girl know that you stopped by and I'll be sure to respond as soon as I can y'all we are on our way to Sephora okay I am in need I am in need of a good lip gloss. Now, I've mentioned to you all in my favorites list uh, sometime last year that I am in love with the Clinique lip moisturizer, but um, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I need something different. So I'm going to go to Sephora, see what they got, and uh, yeah, we're going to see what we can find. I will check in with you, babes, once I am in the store. So peace for now. It's all So I finally got home. I just came in from having dinner with my honey and I wanted to show you all what I got from Sephora really quick. Uh, the Sephora run was definitely a plus. I walked in with, uh, I walked in hoping to walk away with the things that I had saw online. But once I got there and I got a chance to kind of test everything out, I was like, no, that's not what your girl is looking for. So a lot going on outside. Anywho, I ended up getting the Tatcha lip gloss. This is the uh, Japanese, I think it's what, Japanese peach? That's the, the scent or the flavor of the lip gloss. It is the Kiss You Lip Mask, all right? And I can wear this pretty much any time of the day. This is what the lip gloss looks like in the jar. Okay, this is the jar that the lip gloss comes in. And then, of course, this is the lip gloss all right and it's a jelly texture which is what i was looking for um it did come with a gold applicator which is right here um i thought this was a nice added touch not realistic though because there's really no way to kind of keep these things together so this won't be going anywhere with me uh but yeah this is the lip gloss I paid $28 for that. And then I also picked up the uh, Best Seller Super Goop Starter Kit, which I thought was really good uh, for $25. I got three sunscreens. I got the Unseen Sunscreen SPF 40, Glow Screen SPF 40, and then also the Play Everyday Lotion SPF 50. So I thought this was a really nice value. I was, however, kind of thrown off because if you see the packaging, it's very wrinkled, like it's been through a lot. So I was kind of apprehensive, but the other one looked the same way. So I just kind of picked the one that I felt didn't look as tore up. So if this is not how the packaging is supposed to look, please let me know in the comment section below because I'm not going to lie. I was like, what is going on with this? Why does this look like it's been through a lot, like a storm, you know? But anyways... Uh, this is the un Unseen Sunscreen SPF. Okay, so I picked up this one, or this one came in the starter kit. The Glow Screen. Okay, and then also, I think this is the Everyday, Play Everyday Lotion. So yeah, these are really great sizes. I do plan to start using sunscreen on my face. Um, under my makeup and then also just when I'm going out because I don't want to get sunburned and I'm trying to protect my skin. So yeah, I'm going to start using sunscreen. My esthetician had a 
she didn't have a long talk with me, but she almost had a conniption when I told her that I do not wear sunscreen. So yeah, definitely I'm about to start incorporating sunscreen into my routine. And uh, yeah, so I want to try Super Goop. I've, Super Goop, I've seen a lot of great reviews for Super Goop. A lot of black women use this particular brand, which is kind of like what I was looking for because when I've tried sunscreen previously, it always left like this white cast on my face. And that's just not, that's not the look we're going for. So yeah, so that's pretty much everything that I got from Sephora. I did go into H&M, but I didn't see anything. And to be completely transparent, I'm kind of over like shopping fast fashion. That's probably a discussion for another day, but I'm kind of, I don't know, like, I have so many, I wish I could show you all like my closets and my clothing racks because they are filled, okay? And I think I'm at a point where I have enough clothes and I need to start sorting through pieces. Like spring is coming, so I think I'm gonna do like a spring clear out. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of over like the whole fast fashion scene, you know, buying what's trending or what's out, what's new because I don't know, like when I think about the money I spend or everything looks the same. I did pick up some pieces from Ella Koi, but Ella Koi is, in my opinion, honey, she's not fast fashion because she's expensive. Okay, Ella Koi is expensive. But anyways, that's another topic for another day. I am about to go to bed. I think we're about to watch a movie. Um, Batman, we want to see Bane. I want to see Bane. Derek wants to see Bane. So I think we're going to go ahead and watch a movie maybe. I don't know, but I'm going to check in with you babes on tomorrow. I know I probably look sleepy because your girl is tired, okay? But I'm going to check in with you babes on tomorrow. Peace for now. Good morning, good morning, good morning. So we are currently on our way out um, for the day. My honey is behind me. You can't see him. Oh, oh no, you and I was yeah yeah so we're on our way out for the day um we are going to uh go to the starbucks really quick pick up a coffee and then um we're going to visit family today so today is more of a family day it's going to be a chill weekend not too much is going on but i want to check in with you guys it is um beautiful day outside today super cold though super cold so if you're in the maryland dmv area be sure to wrap up because it's cold so i will check in with you babes a little later on peace for now Put some luck in the back. I don't give a what someone, someone say. Finally got my friends in the back of my roller. We gon' make it big one day. We gon' make it big, I say. We gon' make it big, just stay in the, stay in the moment. Stay in the moment with me. Give you a moment to give you a moment with me. Spend all the roses. Spend all the roses with me. See it in your eyes when we leave for the night Way too many heartbreaks still on your mind Let the flame burn down for a while Let the flame burn out for a while Stay in the moment Stay in the moment with me So I am back, finally home. Um, this is actually like my first time vlogging today, like putting together like a like vlogging just in general. So we just got back home uh, a little bit earlier, but I had to do some editing as you guys saw. Um, I have a sister lock update video dropping tomorrow at 9 a.m. So by the time you see this vlog, that vlog would have already been uploaded. But if you have not watched it, I will be sure to link it here. So I just came from the package room. I ordered a bag. I ordered a bag about two weeks ago and it finally got here. It took so long. I thought it was coming from 
like somewhere in the US, but I think it came from overseas. But when I got the package, it did come in this nice box, brown box here. Okay, and then it has the um, the name of the brand. I think it's pronounced Giorite. Giorite. I could be pronouncing this incorrectly. If I am, please put the pronunciation in the dish. Um, if I am, please put the pronunciation in the comment section. But it came in that box, and when I opened the box, it was in this dust bag which I'm falling in love with dust bags. Um, I've always been a collector of dust bags, but I'm finding that dust bags are really good, especially for protecting the, um, preserving your bags. So I definitely like to keep them. And then also when I'm traveling, I like to take the dust bag um, I like to use a dust bag to pr protect my bag, but then once I get to my destination, I'll use a dust bag to stuff the purse so that I can bring it back to its original shape. Um, it came in the dust bag and then it was in this bag. I'll probably throw this away because I, I think this was just probably additional packaging, but now for the bag. Are y'all ready for this? Are y'all ready for this? Y'all not ready for this. Bam. This is the bag. So I got this bag from the brand Giorite, like I just said, and I have actually been looking at this bag for quite some time. It is literally all over Instagram. So when I saw it initially, um, I, I liked it. I fell in love with it, but I didn't buy it because I was like, mm, I want the Prada one. The Prada one is kind of like the one that was, you know, popular or um, calling my name if we you know, whatever. Uh, but yeah, I initially wanted the Prada, but I decided to go with this one because this one was actually a lot cheaper than the Prada. I think I paid 170, 170 for this bag. And I think it's just a cute bag. It's big enough to carry all of my junk and it's not too, uh, small. It's not too small. It's a nice, medium bag you know so i uh, got this bag and i'm thinking i can wear it two ways i can carry it with both of the straps like this or i can always fold one in and carry it like that and if i'm not mistaken i think it comes with a crossbody strap so i'm going to actually take this out now yep it does it comes with a crossbody strap here and uh this is the tag so this is a tag, this was on the inside, and then on the back it just has the um, address for the brand, which, nice quality, nice quality. But this is the crossbody. I'm gonna take it out so we can look at it. Not sure that I'll be using the crossbody, but it's nice to have. This is kinda hitting me like right here, so. Yeah, it's nice to have, like I said. Uh, but yeah, this is the bag. Super excited to use it. I do have some major events coming up soon, um, like here in the next six months. My birthday's coming, so maybe I'll carry it then as well. But this is definitely going to make a debut uh, sometime this year. So be on the lookout for this. I will try to link this bag below. It does come in two colors. It comes in the silver. And then it also comes in, um, well, it comes in the white crystal studs and it also comes in black as well. So I'll link this one below uh, so that you can take a look at it and get your own. And I believe if I'm not mistaken, this brand also has other bags as well. I didn't really uh, take a look at the other bags because I was more so focused on this one. Um, but yeah, I'll link the website below and I'll link this bag as well. Um, in addition to that, I think, no, that's it. That's all I have. That's all I got have in terms of packages. I'm waiting for a PR package to arrive, which reminds me, I need to look at my email and see if it was delivered because I did not see it in the package room, but I'll have to check on that at a later time. I'm going to go ahead and um, leave you all here. I am about to go to bed and watch a movie with my honey 
and uh yeah get ready for tomorrow tomorrow is sunday you know tomorrow is grocery day and i think i'm going to do a little bit of spring cleaning tomorrow i want to do a spring clear out of clothes that i no longer wear so i think i'm going to do that tomorrow at some point so yeah tomorrow should be a fairly busy day so i'll be able to vlog a lot more tomorrow so yeah we'll see what tomorrow brings but I'm going to leave you all for now, and I will catch you all tomorrow morning. Chat with you later, babes. Peace for now. Okay, babes, so I finally made it to the grocery store, and I just got back home. I wanted to do a quick grocery haul with you guys. Um, so starting from here, I have some chicken breasts. I'm going to end up cutting these into uh, tenderloins just so that it's easier to store in the freezer. I also have two packs of chicken thighs. These are skinless. I have some um, or Ida uh, fries. I have the extra crispy and then I also have the extra crispy seasoned crinkles. These are really good. Um, they are 130 calories for three ounces. So these are really good. Just measure them out uh, to, you know, maintain portion control. I also have uh, two steaks here, so I'll put these in the freezer. And then I have some peas, pita, I have some jerk seasoning, and then I also have the jerk uh, seasoning paste. You've seen me use this many, many times. I have my Tone It Up bars. I've tried the, uh, they have the cake, cake one, um, but this time I decided to get the chocolate peanut butter so we're gonna see how these are these are a hundred and seventy calories per bar so not too bad uh, this is great for the morning uh, for breakfast and then I also got the protein shake which you can also have um, for breakfast as well and the protein shake I bought was chocolate I haven't tried the protein shake so this will be my first time I'll let you all know how it goes with this um, I also picked up some Nando's uh, Perinay sauce, really good. I got some uh, Nando's Peri Peri sauce, hot, and then also Peri Peri sauce, medium. And then I got some more blackberries. You all know that we like fruit in this house. I got some raspberries. I got some white rice. I got this rice, blueberries, one red pepper. I think I have a clove. We have some garlic here, bananas, a white onion, kale. Love kale. They didn't have the kale that I normally eat, so I ended up getting this one. I'll just shave like some carrots into it to make it like full of um, to add some more veggies to it. And then I also got some spring mix. So yeah, this is pretty much everything that I bought. Um, I also went to Home Goods and got some candles. I'll show you the candles that I got a little later on because I have to start dinner. So I'll check in with you babes shortly. So it's later in the day. I've already cooked dinner. Um, I gave you guys a glimpse of what I fixed. I am now um, in the kitchen and I'm just kind of cleaning up, but I wanted to show you all what I purchased from Home Goods. I got four candles. All four are the same scent. Uh, I picked up the Sand and Fog Island Blossom. And you know, right now I'm kind of into this whole white aesthetic. And then of course, this is the top, love the top. I do utilize these, uh, these are interchangeable. These can also be used as coasters. So that's the great thing about buying candles that have nice uh, tops or lids. Uh, and this smells really good, it smells so good. $14.99 for each candle. So I got four of these. And I also picked up some cooking tongs. And I believe these are, these are multi-purpose. So multi-purpose tongs. I've showed you guys um, our cooking spoons are wooden. So I saw this when I was checking out. So I decided to go ahead and pick up one. And I paid $6 for this. So yeah, that was everything that I got from Home Goods. Um, not too much of it, not too much of a lot, but I got four candles so uh, but yeah that's pretty much it I am about to finish cleaning taking out the candles putting them away and um, 
yeah, start preparing my lunch for tomorrow so that that will already be packed away and in the refrigerator. As far as the rest of the night or evening, I don't really have much plan. I may do my skincare on camera with you all. Um, yeah, not so much has changed, but you know, you can, I can always do my skincare routine. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and make up the bed once I finish the kitchen and then, yeah, we're gonna chill out for the rest of the day. I wanna catch up on some YouTube. Um, a few people have dropped uh, new vlogs today, so I wanna catch up on those, but that's pretty much it for now. So I will check in with you babes either later on today or tomorrow. Peace for now. Hey babes, all right, currently in the bathroom. I told you all yesterday that we might do um, a skincare routine together, but of course, your girl did not do record the skincare routine. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that tonight. Starting with my Clinique. This is the mild facial soap. I've been thinking about you. I'm waiting for it all to come true. I'm longing to hear you say. To pose a suggestion to the community so you all know that weekly vlogs typically drop on Thursdays at 9 a.m. so the thought process is I will shift the upload date for weekly vlog to Mondays and then drop a sister lock or hair update or hair vlog on Friday or Saturday. I'm kind of just toying around with the idea of switching things around only because I kind of want to start pushing out more content. So I would like more days to do so. But yeah, that's pretty much all for now. Uh, if you have any ideas or any suggestions, please drop them in the comment section below and I will answer them as soon as I can. I think that's all for now. I pray that you all are doing well wherever you are in the world. As I always say, take care of yourself and take care of others. Until I see you guys in my next weekly vlog, peace for now.